So I finally found the best version of Death's individual thought patterns. I'm going to play a three versions, and I'm not going to tell you which one's the best because I think it's kind of obvious. You're going to listen and tell me. Now you might not hear a big difference at first among the three, but there is. It's pretty subtle, and the version I like the best is a 2023 because it corrects three issues that I have with the original, the hi-hats. The 99 improves a little bit on the original, but the 2023 goes even a little bit farther. It makes it really crispy sounding. I'm totally crispy. Because that's the way I like it. Yeah. Especially in the right speaker or the right channel over here. And the next thing was really not an issue until I heard the 2023 and realized what the original was lacking, and that's the definition and bass and the palm meter notes. And the original, when there's a fast part, the notes kind of blur together. There's nothing unusual. But the 2023, it has more articulation among each of those fast notes, and it's kind of like a bop, 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 bop. And I love that. <laughs> And the last one, which really bugs me, is those higher frequencies, that pitch in the original guitars. It kind of sounds like an ice pick in my ear. As of now, I've compared like six versions of this album, and it's like, I think I can do a better job. So I'm going to plan on remixing it, and I'll upload it next time. And after listening to all this, you might be thinking, well, it, it's pretty minimal, the differences. I don't really care which one it is. But I will tell you, in this video right here, same album, these three versions are completely different. <laughs> 